This is Onlook and this is a 100% free AI code editor that we can use to build React websites and web apps. There is no subscription fee and there is no pricing. You can start using this tool absolutely for free. And this tool is not available on web. You can just download this on desktop. Just have a look at this. I have installed Onlook on my computer. It is not available to use on web. So that's why you can simply just go ahead and directly download the desktop app. If you're a Mac user, you can download it for Mac. Otherwise, if you're a Windows user, you can simply just download it for Windows. This So simply just download the file for your operating system and just install Installer. Once you install it, you can simply just log in using Google. But before we start building something with this tool, let me just tell you a bit more about this tool. So let's suppose I just created this landing page. So in here you can see for this landing page, I have all of these different layers, just like Figma. So it's so it creates design just like Figma. You can say this is cursor for designers, where you can simply just give it a prompt and it can create your required design, and then it can show a preview in both desktop and in mobile version. And then you can create as many pages as you want for your project. So all of the code that it is creating is in react you can simply just right click and click on this view element in cursor and it will then automatically open cursor and view the code of that particular element right here in cursor you can now further modify it or you can add it inside your cursor project so you can see right now i have actually already created a next.js project and now the code of this design file is directly opened inside my cursor project. That means I can create as many designs as I want in here. I can like just brainstorm and then I can directly import this design from here inside cursor and start using this inside my project directly. This tool also has this one click deployment option. So let's suppose if you finalize your website, you can simply just deploy that website with just one simple click. To create a new project, you can simply just go to this new project section and from here, simply just click on new project and then start from scratch you can import a project that is already created or you can simply just click on start from scratch and now in here you can give it a prompt i'll simply just copy my prompt i'll press enter and now it will actually start creating website for me again this is a desktop app there is no web version so you can like easily use it on locally on your computer so right now you can see we have given it a prompt and right now it is creating our landing page and just like that our landing page is ready and right now you can see it is showing this desktop view and then it is showing this mobile view now each of these elements are clickable i can simply just like click on each of these elements and then i can like start customizing each of these components from here i can actually change my screen resolution from here or I can simply just like change my mobile resolution as well and then like preview it in a different resolution now to preview this I can simply just go to this preview section and now I can actually easily preview this website so this is what it has created which is not bad this is good enough actually because I provided a very detailed prompt so it just followed that design guideline and then it created this like amazing looking website for me and and in here on the left side you can see i can access all of these different layers this is just like a figma experience but like in a more ai way because all of the code is generated by ai and i can like easily open this directly inside cursor and then i can just implement this inside any of my projects so let's suppose if i have like my main next.js project in here and then i just want to like create a landing page separately in this tool i can just like create in here then open that inside my cursor project i can just simply do that and after that i can simply just like save that as a separate component or as a separate page and then like link it with my project so this is how amazing this tool is just just go ahead and give it a try and let me know in comment section what you think about this tool. I see you next video. Bye bye.